Hello Rocket fans, welcome to the electronics container of the Rocket Shop. I have something, a uh, small thing to show you today. So this is the power supply unit of my reaction control system demonstrator. Um, the batteries connect to those cables here and um, yeah, those small things are the fuses and protection diodes to protect from over voltage. Uh, the battery voltages then go into this relay. This relay can be switched on by this button and switched off by this one. And parallel to this button there is an optocoupler that's driven by this little thing here. That's a voltage checker circuit that monitors all the individual cell voltages of the battery packs through those cables, uh, those balance leads. And normally it just makes a lot of noise with those tweeters here, but I disconnected one of the tweeters and wired um, uh, yeah, those connections to the optocoupler and now basically the voltage checker circuit here can disconnect the batteries from the whole system should they ever drop below a safe threshold without anyone noticing. Mm. And it will still make a lot of noise. Then when the relay is on everything goes to the right side here where my uh, linear regulators are. This one here makes 12 volts and uh, minus 12 volts. This one makes plus 8 volts and this one plus 12 volts. And then it goes back to the middle uh, where the connector for the Arduino is and that gets a whole bunch of um, regulated voltages and the pure battery voltages to power yeah, everything that's connected to the Arduino, um, the sensors and stuff. Also, the voltages go uh, to this small board up here, and that has some additional relays. Those are solid state relays or photo MOSFETs, mm, and they can be driven by uh, this connector here that connects to the Arduino. And they uh, yeah, supply the solenoid valves with um, 24 volts, so plus 12, minus 12. Let's hook it all up and yeah, show you the procedure to get it running. So at first you connect the balance lead of the first battery and then this way. The second one, this will activate the voltage checker <clears throat> and then you can plug in the batteries. Wait, we should do something else. Uh, we should connect the valves now. Like this. And we can also connect the Arduino already. And the connection for the valve signal. Uh, this one here is a Bluetooth connection that will get used in a second. So now everything's connected, now we can switch it on. And yeah, let's say one of the battery voltages drops below 
the threshold. I can just disconnect it to show it. Yeah, and then it starts beeping and uh, turning the power supply off. So let's connect it again. This one's running. And now... we can connect to the Arduino and use it to actuate the valves. That's everything I have to show right now. Bye. <laughs> Copenhagen Suborbitals is a non-profit all-volunteer project. The reason we are getting so close to reaching space on our speaker rocket is because all of our crowdfunding supporters. If you've been following this project and feel passionate about new ways of exploring space and building rockets, you can help us out by going over to our website www.compsub.com and becoming a supporter with a small monthly or one-time donation that helps us pay workshop rent and buy materials. And in return, you get all these insider videos on building a space program which you don't really get anywhere else. So on behalf of everybody at Copenhagen Suborbitals, thank you for your support and we'll see you next time.